I don't know, maybe in the outside world we can see what happens. How about right now? It's not live, so that's good. That's so not true. <laughs> You're pinky down. Hey Kira, glad to see you. Oh here. my god, I How's can't. How's your commute here from uh, Long Island? Do you guys recognize us? <laughs> I'm Kira, this is Cash. We're from the first series of Love Island USA. So on Instagram, I asked you guys if you had any questions for me and Cash. I did not sleep on that. You guys just flooded my DMs, so he asked you guys too. So we're gonna answer some questions today that were asked the most, and mm -hmm. we're just gonna mm -hmm. spill the tea gonna, and let you guys know spill what's up. spill the tea. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> How's life after the island? Life after the island? It's dope. Dope. I mean, yeah. it's not, we're not on the island anymore. I still don't really know what day it is. I still don't know what time it is. At Battle Royale Arena of it was emotion. It's a freaking battle of emotion. My biggest fear was that we would be different people outside of it. So like when you came and grabbed me and like the flight back or like staying together that night, it was, it was the same. We just had more privacy and like could have some conversations we couldn't have on camera and stuff like that. If you and Cash had kids, would you want a boy or girl first? <laughs> Three, two, one. Girl. girl. Hey! Hey! Mm -hmm. I mean, I didn't know that you would say that. Oh, for sure, for sure. I had an older sister too, and growing up with her as my idol and influence was the best thing ever. Are you and Cash dating yet? Oh my good lord. We are still we are negotiating dating. our <laughs> relationship. Throw some more. Throw some more. Negotiating. Every relationship you have, it is a negotiation of understanding the other person in their comfort zone and yours and how those, you know, come together. It's a negotiation. Yeah, I mean, we've been... It's good, though. Yeah, it's really good. I like where it's going. He's a cutie or something, you know. I got the feels. <laughs> oh, the feels. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Me too. <laughs> Do you guys feel pressure for things to work out since the entire world is rooting for you? Oh, this is so sweet! Uh, I don't feel that way, but yeah. appreciate it. I definitely get a lot of threats. <laughs> Cash is such what? a great guy, I swear if you mess with him. I feel you. We're on the same page, we yeah. keep it real with each other. I think that's the best thing that we have is like constant communication. Stop threatening my girl. No, I, I take it. It means that everyone loves you and cares, and I do too. Thanks, guys. <laughs> How do your families feel about the other person? My folks can't wait to meet you. They actually, I saw them last weekend, and they were like, "Tell Kira, like, she's welcome anytime." That's so nerve-wracking. That's the first time I've told you that. Um, yeah, because I, I knew know. that that's what she would say. <laughs> My fam is super excited to meet you, just because. What? I've told you this already. And he's already met my siblings, so they love him, but he's just like, he's a hard person not to what? like. <laughs> What's your favorite challenge you had to do on the island? Ooh. You know which one was our favorite. We're both freaks, so like we, I mean, I kind of acted like I didn't like it, but Loki loved the food challenge. She was all acting all prissy, girly, like me, 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 me. And then when we got to the actual challenge, she turned it on and she was like, stuff that in your mouth. <laughs> Get it into my mouth. Hurry up. Go faster. But I also found out that she did not help on the Flintstones <laughs> footing to like move that You're table a back and forth. Guy. So yeah. I carried the team the you know whole what? time. That was good for you to carry at that time because in the water one, I'm like blindfolding this I was thing. A cheerleader. He didn't help me at all. To this day, I'm telling you, you didn't need help. This What's something that you regret about the island? It doesn't matter because everything happens for a reason, like you said, and like it led us here, mm -hmm. and it bring it, it bring us back together. Yeah, you still you got know? the girl. Still got the you girl. You got me, boo boo. Hey, boosh boo. Hey, boosh boo. Was it hard for you to be so open about your sexuality on the show? How does Cash feel about <laughs> you liking guys and girls? <laughs> for me, um, it wasn't hard to like say that talk about, you know, being into girls and guys. Like the first girl to come out of my eighth grade class, I was like eight, I remember having a crush on my like female teacher at my home and like talking to my mom and I was like, I'm so confused because I feel the way about like 
this girl just like a boy that I had a crush in my class. If anything, throughout my entire life, it was hard for me to understand myself and re really figure it out. So many people don't have like someone in their lives that they can talk to. Telling people in the house, like everyone reacted in such a crazy way, except for Cash. He was just like, that's you, like, that's cool, like, and that was the best reaction that I've like ever gotten. Because it shouldn't be a big deal. I think that's just who you are. Yeah. I remember when you told me and I was like, okay. And you were like, you don't care? And I was like, no. I was raised in a household that you accepted everybody for who they are. Like, that's what I was taught. And so, uh, it, I don't know, just seeing it, I was like, wow, that was really powerful of her to just be so open about that. Yeah. Do you hate Kira for recoupling with Eric? Hate her. <laughs> no, of course not. Of course not. I wasn't mad, I was just disappointed. <laughs> Damn. Cry. I am like on the younger side of everyone there like you know you don't know what you're doing sometimes it was me self-sabotaging you know you don't see everything like we live a whole life in there and it, it all gets put into you know one hour segment of a show and we were having some issues in there at that time just because of the pressure of being in there and you know constantly being around each other and having to talk about things and just things that you don't have to deal with out here and that's when I saw like I came out I saw like how you were still like so supportive and stuff and I don't know, you never know how someone's gonna react. True. You know? Definitely the main two. Still don't. Mm -hmm. Well, you guys, <laughs> thanks for the questions. Thanks for the love mm -hmm. and the support. Mm -hmm. And um, thanks for Kira being in my life. Oh. She's the cutest. Thanks for like all the support <laughs> and the love that you guys send us. It's so surprising because we're just two weirdos that are super awkward when it comes to it so even like when you guys catch us on the streets and stuff we love it if i'm being a weirdo that's just me it's just because yeah we're both super weird but the reason i'm doing this video is we want to just keep you guys in the loop and talk to you and yeah <laughs>